Thanks for watching Mid Morning this Thursday. There's new research from the University of Minnesota about black, black newborn babies. So the research shows that black newborns in hospital death rate is cut in half when black newborns are cared for by black physicians rather than white physicians. So joining us now live on Skype to talk more about her research is Dr. Rachel Hardiman with the U of M School of Public Health. Dr. Hardiman, thanks so much for being with us this morning. Thanks for having me. Yeah, so you have for a long time researched maternal mortality um, and uh, mortality of newborns. Uh, we know that black babies die at three times the rate of white babies, uh, but your research uh, gives us just even just a little bit of insight about why that might be. Yeah, so, you know, what we were really interested in studying with this particular analysis was the patient physician um, relationship and if racial concordance, so having a provider, a physician that is the same racial identity as the newborn, if that mattered for um, for health outcomes, particularly given that infant mortality is such a critical and important indicator of community health and well-being, and also that you know at a very basic level, infants should not uh, should not die and should have the um, opportunity to thrive and live healthy. And this is something that's been talked about for a while, but you looked at a, a lot of almost 2 million births in the yeah. state of Florida to really find this link. Yeah, so we leveraged um, some really important data um, across, you know, almost 20 years to look at nearly 2 million births um, and to understand what was going on here. And what we saw was that when a, um, and when a black infant, a black newborn had a black physician caring for them, the likelihood of infant death um, decreased significantly. It's such important research. And I wonder now, what do we do with this information now? Where do we go? Yeah, I mean, I think that's the million dollar question, right? And the, the thing that everyone wants to discuss. And what's important to say, first of all, is that our analysis doesn't, isn't able to really get, um, get into the mechanisms behind um, what's happening here, but there are um, great fact, you know, researchers and folks really studying this issue. And, um, you know, I think what we have to understand is the impact that race and racism and racial bias play in the healthcare delivery system and really start to unpack what that means for how care is delivered. And so we're not talking about, you know, individual physicians who are doing bad things or are, you know, um, exacerbating poor outcomes because, you know, mostly physicians want to, um, ensure that you know that the families that they're caring for receive excellent high quality care mm -hmm. so it's really thinking about how institutions um you know uh, exacerbate uh structural racism within their within um the healthcare delivery system and thinking right. about the ways to um to fix that and to change that right. moving forward and i know that you and many people over the view are continuing to to look at this dr rachel hardman thanks so much for sharing your research with us today we really appreciate it Thank you. Mm -hmm. Take care. Yeah.